on our law. Liberalizing politics. As if Zoom can guarantee food on the table of the common man. It takes a man with vision to guarantee food on the table of the common man. Let's speak emo and not section. We're on the seventh year, a year of foolish. On the eighth year, 2019, we shall give birth to a new child, a new government. You know why I know that Uche Mosu is very powerful? It's when men and women have to hide in the bush and hide resource shit to write results. Then I know this young man is powerful. Because they could not face him in the world. They could not face him in the local government to conduct pro proper conference. But we shall not allow that. Emo lines, let me say this to you. All I've said to you as a person has all worked out. I cried to you and I said to you, vote President Mohammed Buhari. I even told all of you, whether you vote him or not, Buhari will be president. But let us not be found to be the smallest infinitesimal part of this country. God forbid. A country where we used to be number one. Again, I'm telling you again now. To continue with this good work, to continue with free education, you should vote only at Brian. I need a hard working person. I need an honest person. And never you allow anybody to come to power without you knowing his track record. Never you allow anybody again to talk about holding public office in Imo State who has a bad track record. People do not change because of office. The character you have as a person before office is the character you display in a bigger country as a government. So if you are an armed robber and you come into governor, governorship, you become executive arm robber. <laughs> if you are an internet guru, an internet billboard, and you come into governorship, you become internet guruism. <laughs> Can't you see my track record? Free education. Rochas Foundation. Can't you see my track record? Number one real estate ownership in Abuja. I love construction. That's what I brought to be in Limo State. I've done more construction than anybody in this state. And cement, timber sellers, timber drivers have done more business in these seven years than the history of Limo State put together. I'm sure that would take the biggest customer now is Limo people. Those dealing with timbers, nails, construction materials have not found this group. That's why they're opening shop everywhere, even on the road. Imo State today is the fastest growing city. Go to the New Orleans and see what is happening. Outside Abuja and Lagos, Imo State is the fastest growing, Oweri is the fastest growing city in Nigeria. Oweri have joined with Nazi, Oweri have joined with Moribu. Moribu is joining with Oluso. And this one is joining with Ikebu. Ikebu is joining with Okibu. Owele has become a one city state. Look at our city. For those of you who criticize, the removal of Inaga also helped our security situation. Today our city is beautiful. But I want to urge all those Taizi drivers not to take advantage. After all, these Taizis were bought for them free to pay after a, a period of three years. They should, should stop charging 100 naira for God's sake. This is not London, this is not Lagos. Even a local charges starting naira. Why should he more taxi drivers who are giving taxi on low basis charge 100 naira per passenger? And they don't even charge 100 naira. They put six people in a taxi. I want to ask Commissioner for Transport to find a solution to this as quickly as possible.
before I leave you in 2019, I will ensure that institutions work. I'm sure you are aware that we are making a frantic effort to make sure that institutions work. Today, we have constructed a new labor house, probably one of the best headquarters of labor. We constructed a new NUJ headquarters. We have also built a new pension headquarters. And we have built a brand new Red Cross headquarters. And we have built a new CAN headquarters. All to make sure that institutions to hold firm government to work with our CGC. When institutions work, government cannot fail. And we're using ministers now to develop areas. We have Ministry of Tourism now completed in Ogota local government. Ministry of Agriculture has moved to Ngoapala. Ministry of Works have moved to Kikwe. All this is to bring development in those areas. We are building the new Ministry of Happiness near Concord Hotel. The project will finish in two months. Am I right, Commissioner? We are building a new Ministry of Sports at the old, sta at the old stadium there. And we are building the Ministry of ICT just opposite the court. And we have, we have built a brand new state of the art justice to put a court, the best high court in this part of the world. How many can I mention? And yet somebody can sit down and question and say something about rescue mission. I want to thank you, Imolite. And I want to say to you, I'm not tired. And no shaking, and nothing mega. <laughs> My House Assembly members, let me open this page, speaker, to thank you. Thank you. All this story would have been possible, but for the support and for easy passage of my laws without condition. Remember it better. You are one of the best things that has happened to this commission. Thank you and God bless you. And to you, my commissioners. For the very first time in history, women are recognized in government. Do you know the commissioner for works is a woman? Commissioner for agriculture is a woman. Commissioner for education is a woman. Commissioner for health is a woman. The Accountant General of the State is a woman. The Vice Chancellor of Imo State is a woman. I am gender friendly. My people, my people. I want to thank all of you for late night. I know sometimes when you go out of meeting, I don't know what you say about me. But I'm just imagining that what you speak after you leave the late night meeting is every time this man will come to the meeting, every time man know the rest. Please bear with me. Let's do this job for this generation and subsequent generation yet and born. To immunize, God bless all of you. Please be seated, please be seated. I'm going to first questions now. I'm told I'm going to first some questions. But before that, I just want to take a few minutes and show you a bit of what rescue mission in pictures to buttress some of the points of what I've said. So it doesn't look like I'm talking church Kali without any practical realities. If I may have my eyeglasses, please. Thank you. Please, if you can watch the screen, you can see some of my history and the bit of it. Thank you. Are you, are you scrolling? Thank you. Now, gentlemen, if you look at this picture here, and I'm sure if the picture is on the screen, and if the people can put it right. Now, is it showing there? Thank you. If you look at this picture, you can see I was looking quite young. This was when I came in 2011. And uh, coming in 2011, um, are we there?